Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jer Yora and you are watching Informa TV. At sa video na ito ay tuturoan kita kung paano mag-apply ng NBA clearance online. Okay, sobrang dali lang. I'm not sure kung ano yung purpose mo kung gusto mong kumuha ng NBA clearance but sobrang dali lang mag-apply ng NBA clearance online. Alright, so wag na natin patagalin pa, simulan na natin. Okay? So in your browser, open, uh, open your browser and then go to clearance.nbi.gov.ph and then click enter. Alright. So mapupunta ka sa mismo website ni NBI. Okay. So ang unang mamakikita dito is yung data privacy content. Alright. So merong English, merong Tagalog. Yung basically read the Tagalog and then pag nag-agree ka, so basically click on agree. Okay. And then, uh, an additional information advisory. So, makikita mo dito yung uh, eh, other information. Like, uh, ano yung ID na ipapresent natin. So, we need to present at least two valid uh, government-issued IDs. Like, you need passport, driver's license, birth certificate, and then marami pang iba. Right? And then, once you have read this advisory, you can close this down. And then, mapupunta ka sa mismo website ni company. NBI which looks something like this, right? So, ito yung website ni NBI Clearance. And then, kapag ka first time tayo mag-apply, so you can basically click on this uh, first time job seekers, click here, okay? So, may notice, okay, you know, click on OK. And then, magpupunta ka sa mismong uh, application ng uh, NBI Clearance application, okay? So, uh, fill up na natin yung mga information na nakalagay dito. So, Registration of us of first time job seekers. So basically, ano yung gender mo, uh, male, and then your civil status, uh, single ka or married. I'm married, so married ako. So, birth date, my, my birth date is uh, this one right here. Then, a year. So, so map na natin yung year natin. Okay, and then my first name. So, dapat yung information na ilalagay mo dito is. Uh, tama yung mga spelling, alright? So, middle name, and then my last name is Flora, and then my mother's maiden name. Uh, mother's maiden name is pangalan ng nanay mo nung dalaga pa siya, okay? So, ang pangalan ng nanay ko nung dalaga siya is yeah, Mayas. I don't. Alright? So, ano yung contact number mo? Ang contact number ko is... Okay, lalagay mo lang yung contact number mo dito kasi later on, may marireceive ka ang verification message para i-verify yung information mo. Okay? And then, your email address. Lang mo ilagay yung uh, email address mo. So, my email address is jerichalyora at gmail.com. Okay? And then, for the password. So, kailangan mong gamuha ng password na hindi mo malilimutan. Okay? So, Pagawa tayo ng password. Ulitin nila natin yung password na ginawa natin. Okay. And then, once you have, you have, inf uh, once you have done uh, filling or the necessary information na nalagay dito, so basically, you read and accept the terms and conditions. Okay. And then, scroll down mo lang. And then, uh, agree mo lang yung uh, terms and conditions. Okay. Then click on this one right here. I'm not a robot. Click mo lang yan. And then uh, mount, mountains or hills. So hanapin lang natin mountains or hills. Uh, mountain or hills. Then verify. Right? So once na verify na natin, you can basically click on sign up. Right? So, talagang gagawa ako ng, uh, mag apply ako ng um, NBI online. Kasi I, I need this for job application. So, kailangan kong kumuha ng NBI. Alright. So, nareceive ko na yung um, notification uh, uh, OTP. So, lalagay ko lang dito yung OTP. Okay. And then, uh, submit OTP. Alright. So, i-verify na lang yung account mo. Then, you have successfully registered as first-time job seekers. Okay. Okay, so ganun lang kadali ang mag-register uh, ng account sa NBI since nakapag-register na tayo. So, all we have to do now is 
uh, mag-login tayo sa account natin. Okay? So, yung email address natin, www.shinu.com Then, your password. Yung password na ginawa mo, kung makakalimutan yun. And then, click on sign in. Okay? And then, ah, uh, Uh, magpupunta tayo sa mismo account natin. Right? So, uh, save natin yung password. Okay. So, ito mismo yung account natin. Ito mismo yung application information. So, ilalagay natin yung first name natin. Check natin yung middle name, yung last name, then yung gender. So, yung nickname natin is teacher. Uh, other, other name. Kung may other, may ibang katangal pa, pa kayo. Then, place of birth. So, yung place of birth mo. May place of birth is double nothing. Citizenship, uh, yung citizenship mo. Uh, since we are Filipino, so Filipino ilalagay natin, okay? So, contact details. So, ano yung current address natin? So, current address ko is this one. So, ilalagay mo na dito yung current address mo. So, ilalagay mo dito yung, yung, current, yung current address mo kung saan ka nakatira ngayon. Okay? So, your uh, mobile number, uh, update mo rin yan, and then your email address. Okay? Scroll down mo lang. Okay? And then your spouse name. So, ano yung pangalan ng asawa mo? So, <clears throat> pangalan ng asawa ko is Rose Lee. Then your father name. So, yung pangalan ng father mo. Father name. And, there, and then your uh, father birthplace. So, and then your mother's middle name. And then your mother's birthplace. about the north as well. So, lahat ng information dito kailangan mo uh, mailagay. Okay? So, uh, alimutan ko to. Spouse birthplace. Spouse birthplace is uh, Camarines. So, okay? So, scroll down. So, other information. So, ed educational attainment, college, college level, So, um, uh, elementary ka, high school, or doctoral, or vocational. So, in my case, college level. And then, religion. So, um, Iglesia ni Cristo or Evangelica. So, my church is Iglesia ni Cristo. So, click on Iglesia ni Cristo. And then, your height. So, I forgot what is my height. in centimeter, but um, basically... You need to uh, know your height in centimeter, okay? Para may input natin yung information dito. Alright? So, uh, yeah. one second first, yeah. Then know if that is correct. And then, uh, so, second kilogram. Then, may complexion. Ano yung complexion ko? Ano ba ako? Puti ba ako? Uh, fair lang. Fair lang. Alright? Then, mask. So, hindi naman siya necessary kasi wala siyang uh, star so lahat ng information dito na merong star na tulad nito is kailangan mo siyang lagyan ng information okay kasi pag hindi hindi masasabit yung information okay so once you are happy with all those information na nilagay mo dito so check mo lang ulit uh, save your information and then makikita mo dito yung information mo so, check mo yung information mo your first name then your middle name last name or uh, kung anong status mo, birth date, so basically lahat ang information na uh, nilagay mo is i-double check mo para makita mo kung tama or may mga um, wrong spelling ba or ano ba. Okay? And then once you are happy, click on submit. And then successfully save the information natin. Okay?
Okay, so dito nakalagay yung first and last name ko and then apply for clearance. Alright, so select natin yung ID na meron tayo. So yung ID is UMID and then SSS. Alright, so UMID at SSS. So sa UMID, lalagay lang natin yung UMID or CRN number. So yun lang. ito ay 98 okay so agree lang natin yung terms and condition okay so other and uh, your registration code and reference number will be provided after you save your reference schedule okay let's close natin to and then pipili tayo ng schedule and then which branches uh, kung saan natin kukuha rin yung NDA okay so so nandito sa nasa Laguna ko ngayon so basically uh, pipili tayo ng place na malapit dito so dito natin Laguna So, Lianas. So, meron sa Lianas. Meron din sa San Pablo. So, ang pinakamalapit dito is Lianas. Okay? sa so, may parian lang to. So, malapit na ako dito. So, kawain ko. And then, your schedule. So, pipili tayo. Ang schedule kung saan tayo pwede si March. Is March, March 2020. So, pili ako ng may pera ako. Kasi pag pili ako na wala ako pera, hindi ko makuha yung DI ko. So, basically, siguro kasi ang day off ko is Tuesday. So, basically, Tuesday or Thursday. Okay, so siguro Tuesday na lang. Okay, so Tuesday, pipili natin Tuesday. So, pop, uh, yung appointment schedule natin is Tuesday, March, uh, no, it's March 17. March 24. Ito. So, ang appointment schedule mo, or appointment schedule natin is Tuesday, March 24, 2020. So, umaga to. Uh, sa Liana Supermarket. Alright, so pipili ka ng location and then yung pinakamalapit na location and then yung uh, schedule of uh, appointment okay so kapag happy ka na dun sa information dun sa schedule mo so click mo lang tong button para ma-proceed yung uh, to get your uh, reference number okay so so ito na yung uh, reference number natin so we have to save this ka reference number Okay, and then, pwede natin picturean. So, picture natin itong reference number nito para may reference tayo. So, I need to picture. So, picture ako lang. So, hindi ka magilala. Hindi kayo makasama sa picture. Okay, so, picture ako na siya. And then, I can also uh, uh, print screen din or screenshot this code. Okay, so, screenshot lang natin. Uh, paano ba mag-screenshot? Okay, so, screenshot lang natin. Okay, and then save natin sa ating uh, paint. Ito so, na kayo sa paint. Save so, sa paint natin. Paint. Okay, pinagpapawisan na ako. Pero, okay, so control din na natin para masave yung ano natin. Okay, so na, na, na-save na natin. So, click on file. Save natin yung save us and then okay so click on save I have to save this PC please choose other location so uh, documents save that is other location and then click on save alright so na save na yung uh, uh, clear, uh, yung code reference number natin so uh, para ma-claim natin yung NBA natin, we have to present our UMID and then we have also to get a barangay certificate or barangay clearance, alright? So, kung, kung ano yung ID na uh, nilagay mo dun sa application natin, so yun yung mag-appear dito. And then, in additional documents, mag-present ka ng barangay clearance na pwede mo makuha sa yung barangay, okay? So, post na natin to information na to. So, ganun lang guys. So, Ganun lang kabilis uh, mag-apply ng NBI clearance. So, click na natin transactions. So, transaction natin. So, yeah. so, makikita natin yung reference number and then yung details. So, we can also uh, print the application form. So, kung may malapit kang kung gumawa ka ng application uh, sa computer shop, so, you can print this application form. So, print mo lang to. So, ito na yung application form mo. 
And then, ito lang yung ipipresent mo dun sa NBI para ma-claim mo yung NBI mo. Okay? So, that's it guys. So, that's basically how you apply an NBI clearance online. If you have any questions regarding with this uh, video, then don't forget to uh, leave a comment and uh, below. Okay? So, thanks so much for watching guys and bye for now.